Comic Con, booth 2569, with lots of cool stuff to show you today, including our brand new license. I'm going to give it just a few seconds to fill in. Uh, Jared's running the camera today. Say hey, everyone, say hi, Jared. He's going to let me know uh, how many people are, are watching, and as soon as we get a few followers coming in, I know this is kind of impromptu. This is how the show works, of course. We'll uh, tell you all about our brand new license for Hellboy, the new Hellboy movie, actually. So we got a few viewers there. Got some people filling in. Yeah, it's coming along. Well, thanks again for joining in. I know probably a lot of people are spending their Friday at work right now. They just saw the notification that we're live. And we wanted to show you a couple new things that we didn't cover yesterday. Of course, yesterday we showed off the Rotunda Rex and also the Quarter Scale Dr. Malcolm. And those are incredible pieces. And I have some special information for you at the end of this show to let you know how you can own those very soon. So pay attention. Okay. So. Brand new reveal for the show is our Hellboy Right Hand of Doom life-size prop replica. And of course, the new Hellboy film is our brand new license. This is a wearable piece. I know that's going to be most people's first question. Yes, you can put it on your hand. And it is going to be the ultimate collectible for Hellboy fans and also fans of the new film. One thing we're going to do today, too, is also just kind of pan around. I know some people have asked, hey, can we see the back of the hand as well? Looks a little well, you certainly can. It sounds kind of odd to say, seeing the back of the hand. But hey, you know, if that's, uh, that's how you roll, then we'll go that way. Now, we don't have any pricing information on this. This is just a brand new reveal for the show. We don't have a release date or anything. But if you're interested, stay tuned because we'll have more information, of course, as, uh, as the time goes on. And you can find out more about it by following us on Facebook on Twitter and on Instagram. And always set your notifications on for us when you do. That way you're the first to know when we do post. So we're gonna move uh, we're gonna move to our next item here. Fortunately right now here at the show it's not too crazy busy so that's why it was the best time to do a Facebook Live. Sorry for no warning on that one guys. We have another piece from the new Hellboy film. This is the Hellboy pistol. And that's the life-size Paul Francis collectible right behind it. And this is a super, super cool piece. And we will have this available probably next year, but again, we don't have any pricing information for the Hellboy pieces that we're showing off here. These are just brand new reveals here at the show. And it will come with the bullets like you see here and, and probably that base. The base could be subject to change, we'll see. But this is the same prop, or it's a prop replica of the pistol that's in the new film. And we're going to make that, and we're going to have a lot more Hellboy film pieces to come. So just you wait if you're a Hellboy fan, or maybe you're just a fan of the new movie you saw a trailer for. No, the trailer's not out yet. Trailer, I think, actually debuts uh, this week. They're going to have a panel tomorrow here at the show, and who knows? You might even have some people from the show come by here. You know, you never know. You never know. Okay, so we're going to pan over and show the Rotunda Rex again, because I know a lot of people had an interest in that piece yesterday. Uh, Jared's going to pan around on this as well as I talk because we've had lots and lots of comments on this one and lots of love and, and response to this has been incredible. We really thank everyone's uh, you know, comments for this and also just the feedback we've been getting because it's, it's been great. It's been great here for the fans. And I know speaking personally as a Jurassic Park fan, this is exactly what I want to have in my collection. And looking at this thing, it is glorious. It measures about 22 inches tall and it's about 22 and a half inches in diameter. And this is really one of the most definitive Jurassic Park pieces we've ever created. I don't know if you see it in the, in the camera view here, but we've got the raptor scratches on Rex's skin there. It's beautiful. We've got the broken bones from the other T-Rex, or the, the fossilized T-Rex at its feet. And underneath the base, this particular piece, just like we've done on a lot of our other Jurassic Park statues, or the dinosaur fossils underneath, which I think is a super cool, it's just a neat element to it, and it's a clever way to do a base, if I'll say so myself. And now, you're probably wondering, well, how much is it? When does it go up for pre-order? Well, I'm going to cover that here in just a second. So if you're watching, stay tuned. We're going to cover that information here very quickly. Okay, let's change the lot since what we got on this banner over here. Mr. Boxes, Mr. Boxes. When will it go for pre-order? Yep, Stephen, we'll get that answer to you here very soon. Like here in the next couple minutes, actually. Okay. Now, the last thing we're going to show off today 
is Dr. Ian Malcolm. Yes, it's true. We've turned an internet meme into a statue that you can own. And uh, this has been blowing up the internet. It was pretty cool. Jamie Lee Curtis actually put this on her Instagram earlier. And uh, that was really an honor to see that on her, on her feed. But this is such an iconic moment from the film, but it's also such an iconic moment of Jeff Goldblum. I mean, this is this is just like quintessential Jeff Goldblum right here. And everybody, there's Mike Champion in the back. I'm sketching here at the booth today. Mike is our awesome, awesome art director. He's always working. Mike, do you ever sleep? What a sleep. What a sleep. See, there you go. That's how we are at Chronicle. Always working to try to bring you awesome collectibles all around the world. Okay. Now, to answer the questions you've all been waiting for, you're like, well, when is Dr. Malcolm going on pre-order? How much is it? When is the Rotenda Rex going on pre-order? How much is it? Well, I'm going to let you in a little secret. If you sign up for our newsletter right now on our website, you'll find out really quick. Again, sign up for our newsletter on our website. It's very easy to do, and we're going to put that information out later today. So, again, I can't stress enough, sign up for our newsletter. You've got to do it. It's really important. And the advantage of signing up for a newsletter is you get to find out information like this about new exclusives or new releases and stuff before anyone else does. So that's the best way to find out the answers to those questions that you're all asking. But with that said, Jared's going to let me know if there are any questions in the feed that uh, I haven't addressed yet. Uh, actually, people want to see the T-51 behind you. Well, we're going to save that. Okay. We're going to save that for tomorrow, okay? We're not going to show everything off today. Just a tease. Uh, just a tease for now. Yeah, it's back there. We're definitely going to cover the T-51 uh, on another Facebook Live. And we might do one more Facebook Live later today just to answer some questions that people have. Uh, Dr. Hammond, everybody, just, just came by the booth. That's always exciting. Nice. Check it out, Dr. Hammond. <laughs> Dr. Hammond, this is for you right here, right? Uh, that's always the fun at Comic-Con. You've got people doing some great, great cosplay. And if you find yourself in New York City and you make it out here to the con, please come visit us at booth 2569. I think we've got some funny comments coming in. Jared's going to read them off here. What, what we got going on, Jared? Uh, you were so concerned about making a reclining Jeff Goldblum with his shirt open that you didn't stop to consider if you should. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, a fact, a fact. That's good. Oh, what else we got going on? Well, everybody's just loving what we're showing. The, the Rux is getting a lot of love. Excellent. Hey, let's get a lot of loves right now. Throw me as many hearts as you can if you like this Rotunda Rex. So light up that screen for us. Let's see the, let's see the love coming through. Rotunda Rex is a new sculpt here. It's a new sculpt. Come on, light up the loves. Throw them out there for the Rotunda Rex. And again, if you want to know how much it's going to be and when it goes up for pre-order, you've got to sign up for our newsletter through our website immediately. Oh, there they are. The gloves are coming through. It's lighting up the screen. It's awesome, guys. We're so glad that the response for these pieces has been overwhelming, really. And just, I think it shows that the, the Jurassic Park fan community has a great interest in owning high-end collectibles from the film. And we are more than happy to oblige you by doing so. So just a few more seconds of broadcast here and then we're going to wrap it up and get back to it because the booth is starting to get crazy busy right now because everyone wants to see all this cool stuff. Is Samuel Jackson, or Samuel Dale Jackson Simmer arm available? No, no, I don't think we'll have that one. Maybe as an exclusive one day, who knows. Thank you, Stephen. Appreciate it. That's awesome. Okay. Well, that's uh, that's all for now. I'm going to flip this around real quick. Thanks for joining us on this particular broadcast, and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys.